So we wake up in Flagstaff, see somebody being arrested, which is... I'm not sure if that's a, a good or a bad omen. What do you think, guys? <laughs> it's hilarious. <laughs> Poor fella. Well, not necessarily. He's, you don't know what he's done. Yeah. No, I'm in the cop. It's hot, I Look at that uniform. Boy, and hot. Um. <laughs> <laughs> now, let's talk about the... Um, the city of Flagstaff police car. Uh huh. What are you guys' thoughts on that? It's pretty it's, vintage. Yeah, it is pretty old school, isn't it? And I yeah, think that's but, why I like it, you know. Yeah, but keep in mind, it's got those stripes along the side that add quite a lot to speed. Yeah. It's got to be pretty fast. Yeah. I mean, it's probably fast, but it's no near as impressive as the the charges and stuff back in Connecticut. Well, this is like also a little bit more understated, so maybe it can be a little bit more subtle. People think they can get away from it, no way, it's got racing stripes. Mm. You're mistaken. Mm. <laughs> okay, after that interesting start to the morning, it's time to head to the Grand Canyon. Excited, boys? Excited! Okay. Yeah, pumped. Okay. They say it's the Earth's crack. It is the Earth's crack. <laughs> Alright. I heard it was the Earth's Another crevice. Another driving montage, maybe not so long this time. We'll see. So this is probably the uh, oldest gas station I've ever been to. If you take a look at the, um, I I can see. hopefully you oh, can. Yeah, yeah. At the moment it's up to $4. Give it another minute, it'll probably be up to $5. Um, <laughs> well, it just hit $5. Yeah, okay. That's all good. Well, anyway. It's just going very slow, I think, mm. is the point Paul is trying to make. If you take a look at the design as a whole, I would have to say that there aren't too many like this around here. Are you still recording? Yeah. You are? There aren't too many like this around here. At the moment we're just out of the Grand Canyon. We're at uh, the market, which has picnic supplies as well as film, whatever that might be. Um, we are across the road from the Flintstones campground. I think I might head over and get a photo. There's actually the big Fred Flintstone over there. Probably about 20 miles out from the canyon, right boys? Yeah, absolutely. It's been an absolutely amazing drive so far, right through the desert. Well, I feel like scrubland really. Like yeah, it's like the grassland, with, the plains. Mm. I just have to say that it wasn't that. It wasn't crap, it was quite good. <laughs> okay. That I think it. I'm more excited for the canyon than most other things on this trip, so I'm feeling pretty good. Yeah, yeah, pretty ready for it, pretty ready. So, in our last video, we talked about how slow the gas was pumping. The gas station attendant literally just came out, clicked one thing on the nozzle, and now it's running at regular speed, so I'm feeling pretty stupid. <laughs> Alright, right, time to go, Hey, eh? Let's get out of here. Alright, so here's our campsite. We've got our nice $60 tent set up. Looks pretty sweet. Had any troubles with it, did we, Paul? No, it was pretty good. Pretty we good. didn't really follow the instructions and we were still successful. And that makes me more happy than whatever. Yeah, pretty simple, pretty simple. We've got a nice little fire pit, a bench, there's Snotty just chilling. I think now we're gonna go head out the canyon and go for a bit of a, a bit of a wander. So we made it to the canyon and it is spectacular. It's huge. So deep. We're gonna a bit of a hike. Not too far. More along this way, I think. We can't get all the way down because it's about one o'clock now. So I have enough time to go all the way down into it, but it's pretty incredible. So you're, uh, you've been so impressed by the size of the canyon, you decided you're going to try and measure it, right, Ash? That's right, so I downloaded this app called Easy Measure. It's like a tape measure on your iPhone and we're going to measure exactly how long the Grand Canyon is. This is well, pretty how wide. precise. How wide? How wide. Yeah. It's pretty precise. I mean, I measured a room and it was down to like three centimeters off. So let's take a look and see what happens. Alright, so we're measuring to that point all the way down there. 
저기 계시는 곳이 그랜 캐년의 남쪽 남쪽 사우스림 매드 포인트. And it's only 30 meters. It's only 30 meters. 30 meters. It's not as big as you thought it was. Only 30 meters to the other side of the uh, canyon. Wait, wait, wait. No. No. First. 100, 200, 300, 1,000 meters. Okay. Uh, it, can't, it can't measure more. more than 1,000. So it's more than 1,000? More than, more than a K. Wow. Impressive. Yeah, Iceland, baby. So now we're going to go down into the canyon slightly. Down this way. We don't have a lot of time. We've got a few hours, but we can go all the way down to the bottom. We can go down a little bit at least. It looks pretty sweet. Zigzags up and down. All the way down there. Okay, so we've come now in the Grand Canyon, Paul. How are you doing so far? We've probably come down about a third of a mile, and for all of you that are using kilometers, it's probably about half a kilometer. Um, I'm feeling pretty good. I'm already a little apprehensive of the climb back up. Uh -huh. Judging by the looks on some of these people's faces. Yeah. It's not going to be a pretty one coming up. <laughs> but anyway. Continue onwards. I think we head out in that direction. Along the, the edge of the, uh, the canyon here. You can check out some pretty cool uh, lookouts. How are you feeling, Ash? Good. Good. Good? So, yeah, good. Good? It's going to be a deadly walk up, though. But good. How big would you say the echo is? I mean, is look, up, look up, look up. Echo. Quite, quite a ways down now. Ready? Yeah. How's that possible? I don't know, but it's pretty incredible. Cool. Check out this bird. It's massive. It's on a thermal, that's why. Yeah. What? Something like an updraw. Yeah, higher rises, so if it catches it right, it'll So we've made it down to Cedar Ridge, and uh, we're well inside the canyon now. It's uh, pretty epic. How's, uh, how you been enjoying it, Paul? It's been good so far. The yeah. downhill is definitely probably going to be better than the uphill. Yeah, I think we can all agree on that. But we've got some pretty sweet photos. Seen some pretty cool views. I'm not sure how much further we're going to go down before we start heading back up. Because the light's going to start getting away from us soonish. But it's pretty epic. Oh, Paul, he's doing something crazy. <laughs> Does that too. That's uh, it's just one of the many tricks I can do. Yeah, one of the many. So here are the uh, mules that you can take a ride down onto into the uh, canyon. They're pretty big. They're a lot bigger than I thought mules were. Um, Ash, how are you liking the, the mules? Donkey man wants to bite me and donkey lady over here wants to kick me. But I'm smarter <laughs> than her. Donkey lady. How was the... See, see that? I didn't. Well, she's coming at me. She's trying to lure me in and then she's going to attack me. Hey? I'm smarter hey? than her. How was the, uh, the walk back up, Ash? Man, what goes down must come up. It was tough, but we did it pretty quickly. Fast then we went down. Took us Broke about, me though. Yeah, it took us about an hour, a bit over an hour to get down there and about 45 minutes to get back up, which was pretty good. I don't ever want to hear anyone complain about Sachem steps again. <laughs> right. Donkey lady, I will touch you with my water bottle. No, use your hand, you pansy. Use your hand. Come no. on, go on. Just nope. touch her on the side. Touch her on the side of nope. the head. Donkey lady's gonna bite my hand off. <laughs> She's gonna bite my Go donkey on. lady. Don't Go bite on. my hand. Don't approach her like that. I don't like you gonna hit her. <laughs> nope. Donkey lady's gonna bite me. I don't like living animals. You don't like living animals? Yeah. You just prefer eating them? Yeah. Well, I wouldn't eat a donkey. A meal. You like donkeys too much? No, I just don't think it'll be. It'll taste very good. Well, there you go. Donkeys at the Grand Canyon. We made it back up in one piece.